Okay, uh, good afternoon. Okay, I'm going to continue from the project as f uh, just now. Um, I'm going to start on the ECG part, so maybe I can ask my friend to hold on to the electrodes to measure his heart rate. Okay, once he's hold on to the electrodes firmly, I'm going to um, choose the SL4A icon and I'm going to run this program. Okay, it's going to prompt me to enter a phone number. So I'm going to enter a phone number. Okay, um, if I click start now, um, it's going to measure my friend's heart rate. At the same time, a waveform is going to come out. So as you can see, the waveform comes out, and uh, it's a healthy waveform, and the heart rate is also healthy. So I'm going to demonstrate uh, procedure where every time you see five counts, it's going to take the average and it's going to lock the data and it's going to be sent into Sensor Club, which I'm going to show you in a while. Maybe I can show you that the data is logging right there. Okay, so now I'm going to demonstrate a scenario to you. If let's say uh, the person is encountering um, overworking, so my friend is going to put down the electrodes okay. and in a while you will see an SMS alert come into the phone you will see the waveform going down and then the reading is none or it just goes sky high and in a while you see a SMS being sent to the phone okay. as you can see it says that the personal uh, beats per minute is in critical region. So I'm going to click on the link provided. It's going to bring me to this Sensor Cloud website where the database is stored. So I'm going to show you the table where you can see that at this time, on this date, at this latitude, longitude, at this global position, the measured value was zero beats per minute, so this shows that no value was taken, and uh, yeah, an SMS was sent to the user. So 